Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of this Skyrim playthrough. And we're here today to participate in a little bit of royal infatricide. So we're here at the wedding of a very fine young lady who's the stakeholder of the Empire East Company in Skyrim. And we're going to assassinate her. Let's see, I'm going to poison the arrow. Let's see, we... Potent lingering poison, that sounds pretty good. Oh, that's not Lydia singing. Come on, lady, are you going to make your public address? Wait, I think that is Lydia singing. What the hell are you doing? Oh, no, it isn't her singing. Ah, screw it. Uh, I think we might have screwed it up, because I tried to assassinate her in a way that I wouldn't make me detected. Also, how, how, do, how have I gotten a bounty when I... No one spotted me. Oh, hey, dude. Astrid ordered me to keep an eye on you. Figured you could use a hand when the chaos erupted. I'll try and hold him off as best I can. You get back to the sanctuary. Sure thing, man. What was that? Ah, screw it. You know what? I might as well just belt it. Hang on, can I fast travel out of here? I think I can. Oh, I can. I, I didn't. I didn't figure that I could, considering I just got a one thousand gold bounty on my head. But oh well, I can travel out of there now. Well, I mean, it's, I don't know. I tried to do that in a way where I wouldn't be detected or get a bounty, but. I think even in spite of that, that was still a fairly successful assassination. <laughs> the news is everywhere. Vittoria Vici, the Emperor's cousin, butchered at her own wedding. Well done. And indeed she... Let's like, see his eminence just... try to ignore this. No. And indeed she bled like a stug pig. With Vici's murder, you've started us down a path the Dark Brotherhood hasn't traveled in centuries. The assassination of an emperor. And now your reward. A unique spell to summon a legend of the Dark Brotherhood. His soul serves us now in death, as his body once did in life. Unfortunately, in your zeal, you failed to eliminate Vici while she addressed her guests as directed. I'm sorry, but your bonus is forfeit. Damn it! Now then, time to proceed to the next stage of the plan. Go and speak with Gabriella. She's been helping me arrange your next contract. <sighs> Damn it. Oh, well. Dear sister, I've been waiting for you. Your next contract awaits, as I'm sure Astrid indicated. She did, so what are the details? With the Emperor's arrival in Skyrim now a certainty, his security service, the Penitus Oculopus, will need to begin its preparations immediately. The fuck is that noise? Security is being handled by a Commander Morrow. Astrid and I have devised a plan to break the man, and in doing so, cripple the Emperor's protection. You are to slay the Commander's son, Gaius Morrow, and once he is dead, plant false evidence on his body, implicating him in a plot to kill the Emperor. Okay, so... I, Gaius Morrow will have to die then. He is set to leave the Penitus Oculotus outpost at Dragonbridge, and inspect the security of each city in Skyrim. Go there now. Observe Gaius Moro's departure and follow him. Waylay him in one of the cities and send his soul to Sithus. Once he's dead, plant the incriminating letter on his body and let fate take care of the rest. Oh, and one final thing. Yeah? To earn your bonus, do not kill Gaius Moro in Dragonbridge or on the road. Kill him in one of the other major cities he'll be visiting. There, the body will be discovered quickly, as will the letter implicating Gaius Morrow in the plot to assassinate the Emperor. Do that, and Astrid has authorized me to grant you a rather unique bonus. It is a special token to be given to Olava the Feeble in Whiterun. Olava is an old and dear friend, and a powerful seer. The token entitles you to a reading of your future. It's an opportunity one should not pass up. Okay. Walk in Gaius Morrow's shadow and deliver to him the judgment of Sithis. Oh, so that's what the weird squishy, squishy mulch mulch noise was. It was this frostbite spider. Hello, little guy. Alright, I, I genuinely. While I was talking to. Gaius Morrow's. Gabriella, I, I just kept hearing that mushy, mushy noise and I didn't realise it was that spider walking around in the mud. So, as per Gabriella's instructions, we've got to find Gaius Morrow 
and kill him while he's inspecting one of the city's defences. And we've got to do that, preferably in one of those cities that he's inspecting. And not either on the roads or in Dragon's Bridge. Okay, so here's Dragon's Bridge. It looks to be a stone bridge that's made in the image of a dragon. And I think it looks like it's got some dragon bone on it. Ah, oh, here's Gaius Maro. Father, don't worry too much. I'll be fine. I know you will, but all the same, remember everything I said. Stay alert. When you get to the cities, make your observations and move on. I understand, but you're being paranoid. I'm inspecting security, not charging off into battle. There's not a lot that can go wrong. Son, when the Emperor's safety is concerned, anything could go wrong. Off with you now, and good travels. Oh, Fida. I may travel alone, but you know I carry you always in my heart. I'll see you soon. So he's a hard-working young man with a proud father and a lovely girlfriend. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> let's see, let's go into this outpost and see... You must be lost. The tavern is down the road a piece. Oh, yes, of course, my good sir. I will go to the tavern in due course. I'm not going to wait until you're asleep and then steal this travel document. Come. Let's see. Mondras, Solitude, the Emperor's Tower. Okay, so it seems like he's going to Solitude first, it would seem. Come on, Lydia, let's go. Hang on, how far is it to the Solitude? Oh, for fuck's sake. I'll just fast travel there, fuck it. See, how far away is Gaius Maro? The Emperor's cousin killed. Right here in Solitude. I feel nothing but shame. Yeah, I know what you mean, man. It's, uh... Yeah, it's uh, a <laughs> terrible shame that she was assassinated. I wouldn't know anything about that. <laughs> okay, Gaius Mara is nearby. I fast travelled to Solitude and that took up a bit of time of him walking really slowly along the road. So we're going to try and hunt him down. I think he's going into Solitude through the kind of semi-underground entrance near the main guard tower. So we're going to try and hunt him down while he's going there. Hopefully we can do it while no one's looking this time. Make it a little bit... Violent, but somewhat more quiet, I hope. Come on, where are you going? Seriously, where is he going? <sighs> and I'm gonna wait an hour and see where he ends up after that. Oh! Hang on, what? Oh, you're joking. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, I'll go to Dawnstar. I think he's meant to go there, right? I don't like this mission. Oh, where's he gone now? Wait! What? Where has he gone? How has he gone all the way over there? Oh god, where is his next place after Dawnstar? Solitude. And then Windhelm. Windhelm, okay. Right, we've got to go there then. I mean, he's still got quite a long way to go, so we should get there in time. Let's see, where is he? Oh, fuck's sake. Alright. Just... Wait an hour. Wait. Where the hell is he? Oh, you've got to be joking. This guy moves around as erratically as he... Oh, I hate this... I have important business I must attend to. Oh, there he is. Holy shit. Oi, he started it. Okay, maybe I've screwed up. Okay. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do then. I'm gonna go back to when I was in Dawnstar. And instead, I'm going to fast travel all the way to Riften immediately, instead of going to Windhelm first. Let's see, because he's right there, so it should still take him a while to get to Riften, I think. So he's on his way to Riften, so he should be here soonish. Maybe what I'll do this time, instead of just attacking him, I should try and initiate a conversation with him to try and aggro him a bit and piss him off. Then I can kind of get him into attacking me and... Maybe that will reduce the chance of the guards attacking me in turn and me getting a higher bounty. So I think I'll try that. I will need to do it when he's alone though. I'm going to quick save I think and then I'm going to wait one hour. Let's see. Okay so, wait where did he go? Yo no! No! That is bullshit! I waited one hour and he goes all the way from here to all the way over there! You're joking! Oh, this game is just so... White run. Okay, let's go there instead. Oh, I fucking hate this mission so much. Oh, it actually sucks. 
Right, where is he? Oh, he's travelled away somewhere, hasn't he? I'm like the crappiest assassin in the world. I oh, this fucking guy. Oh, fuck's sake. He's just stuck at the East Empire Trading Company now. So, I went to Markarth, I waited there for two hours, and nothing happened. So, now he's just stuck on the road. Oh, God. You know what? Screw... Forget fucking killing him in one of the major cities. I'm just going to murder him here on the roads. Fuck it. Sure, I'm just going to, like, go up onto the road, and I'm just going to find him picking his nose. Keep back, citizen. I have important business I must attend to. After I kill you, I'm going to kill the Emperor. What? Filthy assassin. We'll see who lies dead. Never should have come here. Yo! God, no! At <coughs> your best? Huh? Fuck, and finally done with the bastard. Right. Take the letter from his father. See, and then incriminating letter. Where's the incriminating letter? There we are. Right, let's go back to Gabriella. Christ, I made that so much more difficult than it needed to be. Jesus, good God. Ah, oh, at last. I've been anxiously awaiting your return. Gaius Maro is dead. Yes, I know. As does Astrid. And you've earned your payment, though the bonus is forfeit. As I'm sure you're aware. Honestly, I don't care. You know that we have a more pressing matter to deal with. It's... Cicero. There's been an incident. You should proceed into the sanctuary. I'll let Astrid explain. Oh god, what's he done? Just try to relax, Bizarro. Let the elixir do its work. You'll feel better shortly. Ah, uh, thank you, dear. You are most kind. The jester's cut feels as bad as it looks, I'm afraid. Damn it, this never should have happened. We knew better. We knew better, and still we let our guards down. Ugh. I'll admit, even I'm having a hard time disagreeing with you. Marrow is dead, I know. But we've got bigger problems right now. What happened? I mean, Gabriella mentioned something about Cicero. The fool went absolutely berserk. He wounded Vizara, tried to kill me, and then he fled. I knew that lunatic couldn't be trusted. Oh, it's true, I'm afraid. Cicero was a little whirlwind. Slashing this way and that. It, it would have been funny if he weren't trying to murder us all. Don't forget the ranting and raving. About the Night Mother, how she was the true leader of the Dark Brotherhood. And Astrid was just a pretender. Look, we've got to deal with this situation. You've got to deal with this situation. Okay, so what do you want me to do? I want you to find that miserable little fool and end his life. But first, find my husband. Make sure he's all right. After the attack, Onbjorn flew into a rage. When Cicero left, Onbjorn went after him. They disappeared into the wild. Search Cicero's room. Maybe there's something in there that sheds some light on where he might have gone. Let me know the minute you find something. I've got to see to Vizara and calm everyone down. Tested by a fool. Who's the fool now, hmm? Hush, Vizara. You were very brave. Astrid may well be dead if not for you. This She's right. I'll be forever in your debt, dearest brother. Now be quiet. Just... just rest. Uh, I get the feeling Astrid may have put Cicero up to it, possibly, but... Who knows? Anyway, I think I'll leave it there for the time being. This has already been long enough of an episode, in spite of my screwing up. Although, then again, that's kind of par for the course with my skill set. I am master of screwing things up in my playthroughs. So, I hope you guys did find this video interesting, or at least somewhat enjoyable. If you did, leave a like, share, and subscribe. If you have any suggestions for future episodes of this playthrough or future gaming videos, let me know in the comments section down below. And if you want to check out anything else I do online, I'll leave the links to my social medias and other YouTube channels channels in the video description below as well. But as always, have fun, stay safe, wash your hands, take a mask with you to the shops, take care of yourselves, and I've been Get Bag the Great, and I'll see you guys next time on the battlefield.